I think it's gelatin, gelatin, gelatin. I don't know, maybe they'll tell me. They said I said it wrong. Anyway, Campionis Taste of Chicago. Okay, I'm getting ready for the show. One of the owners, he texted me, he's like, hey, when you're done with the show, why don't you come up in here and we'll give you some amazing Chicago beef. And I'm like, Chicago beef? I'm from Chicago, I was born in Chicago. And I'm like, let's do something different. Everybody who's in there, we're gonna buy them lunch. Let's go over and support some local business. Let me grab some outright bars. See my car over there? Let me grab some outright bars out of there, bring him some treats. Let's go have some beef. So here's Campionis right here, Taste of Chicago. I don't like to taste Chicago. I just don't want to pay the taxes. I don't want to live through the winters. This week, we got all benefits being in Tennessee, all the benefits of the weather and the beautiful country and the Second Amendment. And we'll get some Italian beef. Let's go. Let's see. Everybody, come on. So this is it. Hey, sir, I need, I need you to be here. This is your craft, Absolutely. this masterpiece. So what? tell me about the bread. It's dipped, so it is yeah. moist and juicy. So it's Toronto bread from Chicago, so it's authentic. But yeah, we dip the bread in the, in the au jus, just like uh, you would have it. Uh, oh. mm. The beef is super lean. Like there's not like you ever bite into beef and you're like, get that. It's, it's I mean look at this. Yeah. I mean this is almost diet food, but it's not. And the bread. It's it's soft. You can tell it's soft and fresh. But if you look, it's dipped. Yeah. It's dense. It holds the holds the grain. And the peppers are perfectly cooked. And they're not overcooked. Now, I've been to Portillo's. We had one right by our house about a hundred times. This destroys Portillo's. And I'm a big fan of Portillo's, but you got them beat. How many locations do you have? Just one. Can we get one in Brentwood? Do you want me to franchise <laughs> one? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. This is amazing. Anyway, I would shake your hand. My hands are a bit wet. And right now. We'll do a fist bump. How about that? There you go. Anyway, so tell them where you're at. We're in uh, Gallatin, Tennessee. Uh, the original Campionis. Can't be beat. Oh good. Be sure to come here. Tell Mark Lovine to set you. Already. So check it out. A lot of you guys are worried about your macros. Okay, now I've been doing this a long time. The bread is probably around 50 grams of carbs. The beef is super lean. Thomas, show them that beef. Not one thing of fat on it. I would guess in this you have about 45 to 50 grams of protein, about 45 to 50 grams of carbs. Fat's gonna be around 10. For me, that's actually lower than my macros for a meal, which means that I could budget in a cannoli. This is literally food you can diet on, food you could bulk on. So if you're into that kind of stuff, if you're not just out here, yeah. whatever, if you're counting your macros, my guesstimation on macros is about 50 protein. I'm gonna guess a little high on that. Around 50 carbs and around 10 fat. This is the leanest sandwich you could probably find. So if you're looking for something, you're in the Gallatin area. Greater Nashville area as well. Drive yeah. up here. So good. How's it? How's it? Amazing. Yeah. And Pres Preston counts his macros all the time. <laughs> like Dad said, the beef is really good. You're gonna drop the beef. Don't drop the beef. You already did. Oh, no, he, no, he just still spilled. Oh my goodness, <laughs> Anyways, Preston. We're gonna get to Eden, so.